At the Committee to Stop Children's Murders, officials think the best way to keep Atlanta kids safe this summer is to send them out of town. As we reported a month ago, Venus Taylor is putting together the Atlanta Children's Summer Project. Estimates now say they hope to send 1,000 kids to out-of-state summer camps as soon as school lets out, and 5,000 by the time summer ends. Committee literature says the program is for black children only. Those interested in camperships will have to fill out an application, though those applications are not yet printed. We are also told priority will be given to brothers and sisters of victims. The cost of the camping will be paid for by donations to the committee, but committee staffers say they plan to ask the Atlanta business community for help. Reportedly, letters to potential donors are now being printed. At the Salvation Army, summer camp organizers are looking for money, too. That group has six day camps, which can accommodate a total of 1,200 children. This summer, the Salvation Army wants to expand its camping hours to all day, but it can't do that without more money. If we don't get the money, we'll be spread much more thinly, and we'll have to cut down on uh, the number of hours we can serve the children, and we will not be able to uh, send transportation into outlying areas to pull more children into the programs. Programs include swimming, team sports, and quieter pastimes. Officials say their purpose is to keep 6- to 15-year-olds off the streets this summer. And at 3 to $5 for a whole summer, they say it's a good deal. They have to decide by June 1st about the expanded programs, but if grants and donations don't come through, they know what that answer will be. Hank Phillippe, Action News.